Okay. All right, it's official. I got a backup copy running, just in case. <laughs> All right. Okay. <laughs> it's the I got the stream running on the on the kitchen here, and I heard that I thought the camera just turned off. Doug's staying inside because uh, I've got the gate open because the gravel truck is supposed to actually was supposed to be here by now. I've been waiting for him. This morning, got up early, been working away, got more t-shirts done, every time I add them to the category, it blows up, uh, anyways, but uh, we had a fox here last night, so Doug was outside like a 6 a.m. sharp, running around barking, um, here's the fox, I, I actually got to see it. It, um, it runs down the driveway. It's coming from across the highway, comes down the driveway, and uh, Doug was laying um, in the window looking out the driveway, like he does at night, and uh, he just lost it. So then he was at the back door just freaking and peeking. Oh, freaking and peeking. And the fox was standing right there. Right there, it was like, I, I saw him clear as a, Clear, clear as a bell. Well, I got the silhouette. I couldn't, I couldn't see the detail. And he stood there and he looked right at me. And Doug was barking his head off and the fox was standing there looking like, ah ha ha, I know that dog's not coming outside type thing. So, the fox has figured out the night time he can run through here and not have any problems. I was really hoping that uh, the gravel truck was going to show up first thing. I thought they were like, he said he'd be here like first load in the morning. And, you know, I figured if they start here, if they start working at 8, load the truck up, they'd be here, you know, like 8.30. Because I'd like them to come down the driveway when it was frozen, because it was frozen this morning. Instead of when it's all mucky. Because this is a, a, a full load of stone so it's going to weigh the maximum allowed amount and it's going to make up a mess of the driveway if it's soft look at this eh? they want out because yesterday they discovered mud yesterday right here they had this whole area all drilled out Coming with water, you little rascals. So this morning I'm suffering from uh, a stiff neck instead of the ink and back. Whoa! All right, ducks, you're not getting out. You don't even think of it. Look at them, eh? They're going towards the door. <laughs> they give us lots of eggs today. Today's food bank run. Wonder how I'm gonna groan and moan this morning on the uh, the egg run. I've got all the other streams turned off because I'm trying something here, folks, on the bandwidth issue because uh, we lost four minutes yesterday of this live stream. But I don't know if it's because of I don't know <laughs> Wi-Fi. I, you do Wi-Fi. It just doesn't cooperate. You got some molten uh, geese hopping. Holy mackerel, they ever. Some rough looking birds here.
springtime, things are melting. All right, what do you got in here? Come on, bird, move. Okay, nothing in that nest. Come on, girl. Come on. Are you on? Oh, holy mackerel, folks. Look at this. Okay, I hear a big truck. I just heard the engine brakes. Oh, folks. We're going to be live streaming a, a dump truck getting unloaded. No, they just drove by. <laughs> I thought they were coming here. So, six goose eggs. I think we got seven, eight, seven or eight females laying because we got one yesterday. Yeah, I thought for sure that was the big truck coming in. I got the gate open, waiting. They must have had problems this morning. Well, we still got one more day. Well, it's gonna come some, sometime today, we'll get the load here. We gotta get the full load so that when the melt really hits, I'll be ready. All right. What do you got for us today, ducks? We got some ducks just camping out here. They're not spending a lot of time inside. Okay, oh, I, mean, I am a little still stiff. <laughs> I just discovered bending down to the ground. Bend the knees. <laughs> I'm not making as much noise this morning, eh, folks? But I have been up since 6 a.m., so I've been doing a lot of moving around, working at the desk, folded some laundry, washed dishes, been a real little domestic uh, <laughs> unit running around the house playing catch up because I'm, you know, I'm not doing much of my, my life work here because I'm busy working on the uh, the website for the show. Which yesterday, I uh, I had a, a brain fart in bed the other night, and I got up yesterday morning and I yeah, I was right about my brain fart. Come on, Dot. Um, I end up using uh, the YouTube bulk edit tool. Come on, Dot. God, oh my God, you're just a tough duck. Hey, relax. <laughs> Oh, boys, just ready to kill me, eh? <laughs> she was all fluffed up, trying to look tough. Um, yeah, so the YouTube edit tool, yesterday the bulk tool, I had the brainwave. I said, I, you know, I gotta put the link to the store on uh, all the videos. And I got like 3,700 videos. We can't very well go into each one and add the link, so turned out I was right. The YouTube bulk tool allowed me to put the link at the top of all the descriptions of the videos. So yesterday that was, but I had to do a couple test runs first because I didn't want to, I didn't know what it was going to do or and I didn't want to make a mess that I couldn't undo. So I screwed with that a little bit yesterday, but anyways, that's done. So the link for the store is officially 
on every single video I have all 3700 plus <laughs> but the link is you know, we're raising ducks for charity I think it'll, some people will be like watching oh cute little ducks and then they'll see the link and go oh they're food <laughs> oh I hear a truck no I keep hearing noises thinking it's a truck back's getting sore bending over oh look at this tiny <laughs> tiny's got playing mom too oh tiny are you in a little bit of a trance here Oh, well, it's confirmed, eh? Tiny's a female. That's why she was getting hurt this winter. All the males mounting her. What? Oh, yeah, look at that, eh? She's on six eggs. Hey, you got the mother instinct in you, don't you? My little goose. <laughs> the one that I saved. I remember that day. I thought for sure she was a goner. I found her. That was the day we got hit with lightning here. A lot happened that day. <laughs> Dealing with lightning. Had to run to Ottawa to get parts. Which didn't help because... Or did help. I think we're, oh, I'm trying to remember. Yeah, it did help that time. The parts. It was the second time it didn't help. I don't know. It's a blur, folks. A lot of stuff happened here last year. I know one thing, this being outside thing is really taking a load off of me. It's giving me a lot more time to uh, to work on the computer and seize up properly, you know? So if you're gonna seize up, you should do it the right way and really seize up. I ordered some egg trays for them and our feeds too. Because, uh, the problem with the egg shells and that is that they're sitting too close together in the uh, trays and they're getting cracks and the health inspector, you know, you can't have any cracks. So even though the cracks happen from being in their egg carton. So I ordered a box of those, of flats. I couldn't get goose, I mean uh, uh, turkey egg flats. So we're going to use the chicken and just put them spaced out instead of 20 on a tray. Turkey's 20, 20 on a tray. Chicken's 30. We're going to put 15. Or whatever we can without them touching each other. So that we don't have broken eggs. Yeah, it is a big load of eggs today, folks. These ducks are just pumping the eggs out. So the food bank has got the eggs out and the health inspector said they have a, have to have a sign saying that they are warning these eggs are not graded or inspected and uh, you know you could die <laughs> it's like oh uh, I don't think anybody at the food bank really cares eggs are eggs when you're hungry And your fridge is empty. Oh, that's a good bucket. Oh, folks. Well, I'm not groaning, but I'm just I'm sore. Hi, little duck. So stripping my goose. What do you got going over here, duck? You're on three legs, eh? A stripper. So we're going to be well over 600 eggs to the food bank today. That's pretty awesome. You know, you consider this folks, like by weight, that's like delivering 900 chicken eggs by weight. That's a lot of food. You know, 
I'm, I'm pumped about it. As you can tell, I'm getting a real kick out of this. Oh, it's uh, that's a lot of that's a lot of people, man. We're touching a lot of people's lives in a positive way. Really in a positive way. I, I, I never would have thought that, you know, starting a YouTube doing gardening videos that I'd end up becoming, you know, such a positive, uh, 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 such a positive thing. I just, I, I never would have thought that. Oh, I would so like to be outside, but I gotta work. I gotta get on to, I wanna start doing new projects. I'm getting sick of doing t-shirts. I got two more logos to do on t-shirts and then I, I want to start doing like keychains and all the other stuff. Okay, let's go to the, uh, the hospital. See how our little ducks are doing over there. That's a big bucket of eggs, folks. Oh. Yeah, the little fox. He ran through here. <laughs> Doug was just oh, freaking out. Any marks? Doug's paw prints this morning. He came out of the house and he's just like bang straight over to here where the fox is cutting through the property. This is exactly where the fox was standing looking at me with Doug barking his head off. Cutting through. Folks, you have no idea. Like, it's cool right now, but you can really feel the sun heating up. Oh, it's eight degrees. Oh, I heard birds. I sound like a red-winged blackbird. That means spring's really coming. When you hear those guys, they're coming back. All right, how's my little hospital ducks? The whole winter inside. This girl, 10 more days she'll be able to go out. This one, she's gonna be, but I, I gotta figure out something because I can't have her in here alone. And she can't go back to the flock because she's being on antibiotics. She needs at least uh, three weeks because the eggs are. So. I got a situation there. She's gonna be alone. Unless I put her in the barn. I could do that. Do a barn setup. I'm gonna think of something. I just don't want her in the garage alone. <laughs> Dougie, this morning, he was running around. He was a beast. He, uh,. <laughs> Like he wanted outside really, really bad this morning. He knew that something was here last night. Okay, here, here. Oh, sand everywhere, eh? Well, that's the sand this winter from the salt harp and the ice. Well, that's the old feet off here. I know there's duck poop browned into the bottom. Okay, folks. <laughs> this is <laughs> this is a lot of eggs, folks. <laughs> it's like well, I know my tray that I use for washing uh, can barely hold them all. Okay, I'm gonna get my breakfast happening too. I haven't done that yet. I gotta eat breakfast today. I've been screwing up not. Okay, well, I got a copy, a GoPro copy, so I will be posting this, uh, a copy for you. So if the stream was bad, you'll have a good copy. There you go.